Gear. Problemo. Hello YouTubers and the Groovers and welcome to this episode of Take It Fear Out of Gear with me Jason Bangers and me Mr Chumley Warner. Oh we've really put ourselves in at this time. Oh yes we well have. The old Bosch Radio Valve will explain to you sort of like how they work, what does what. Covered in cobweb so we're gonna it doesn't work. Uh, we'll have a little We'll show you live, I guess, trying to work it. Someone's had a go at this, isn't they, Si? Yeah, yeah, yeah. It needs a bit of TLC, doesn't it? And it looks like it's been left out in the rain. Um, do you know, all that time I've been looking at the monitor and not once looked at the camera. Well, it doesn't matter. We'll go with that. Anyway, this is for our friend Seaside, OK? Uh, this is for Paul. He's asked us if we can fix this. Um, we've never claimed to be fixers of the impossible. Uh, however, we think we might be able to get this working. To a degree, not yeah, 100%, yeah. but I'm no. sure we can get. If we can't get a sound out of this, assuming the valves all light up, um, then there's something wrong in there. Yeah, yeah. That's uh, being no valve, valve yeah, that, expert. Mm, that yes. Exactly. So, so, tubes. What we'll do now is we're going to show you the back of it, and uh, side so probably explain to you what's going on a little bit inside. So here it is, tubes. It's an old Bush valve radio, and. We can tell you that all the valves are light up at the back, so um, we haven't bothered filming all of this for you to show you, all right? So the radio is king, so it's in shot, and we are not. We could have used another camera, but why do that? It's too simple. Um, have, you the, got, have you got your tools, dude? Um, your tools? Yeah, yeah, I've got tools. What have you got? Um, yeah. Oh, nice. Stable gun. Yeah, yeah. yeah we stable can, gun. We fix, can, fix it with that. We can stick the back back on with that, can't we? Yes. Yeah, okay. we'll start, I've got something. Where, oh, hang on a minute. What you got then? I think I've got something. Oh, look at that. Where's look. your tool? Look at that. Ah. Oh. Just right for tapping those valves with. Look at that. Nice. Oh, yeah. That's going to do the job just Yeah. Oh. <laughs> kibosh, kibosh. Nice one. Anyway, so the valves all light up, right? Everything's lit up. And, um, well, let's have a cheeky little reach around, shall we? Um, now, as you can probably hear, there's, there's something now. So if you've got this problem, there's definitely the amps working. And that's, that's, the, that's the band tuning, so it goes from medium wave, long wave, so yeah, yeah it's changing. And it almost sounded like we got something there, so I've got a feeling the problem is this switch here, so I didn't you? Yeah. I mean, that switch needs a good clean. Sure, in between there. There, nearly, nearly had a channel there. What, what about the volume? That obviously works. Yeah. Well, the volume's, yeah. Yeah. If we keep crackling. Well, you can hear the volume's working. See if the tone works. So we're making a crackle. So the amp's working. And tone's working. Yeah, you can clearly hear the tones working there. Yeah. So, what, so what we're doing is using, using the interference from the dodgy switch to test the other things are working tubes, all right? So what do you reckon? Do we should turn it down and then work that switch, see if the contacts on that switch are... Yeah, I guess so. All touched up. Oh. So, um... Oh, I can see the tuning, tuning wheel from the back here. Yes. That's, that's working all right. Yes, yeah, that's is. going round nice. All right, so what we're going to do now is we're going to take a little pause... I'll give it a clean. We're not going to film us cleaning it because why do you want to see us cleaning it? That'll be terribly boring. We're going to put the J Edgar in there, get the cobwebs out, and after giving it a clean, a little bit of WD-40, I reckon this will come to life. So, what do you think? Yeah, and I reckon if we if we work that channel, yeah, uh, well, sorry, that band switch, because I think that's that's tarnished and it's yeah. just making nasty if noises. We get so. some WD in there as well. That'd yeah. be handy. Yeah, 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 yeah,
And then there's this text, which is definitely the, the weirdest. That was quite weird about Big Brother Fred, but this is going to give you nightmares. Here we go. We're wandering into foreign territory now. Oh, that sounds like a lovely time, though. Hey, you can sample that and use it on your latest production. Yeah. Well, it was a miracle finding that radio station because, believe me, we've been on this for a long time. In fact, so long that we should have used the axe and the staple yeah. gun. Yeah, well, you can still use the staple gun, stick the old backpack on, that'll be fine. Yeah. Oh, a sports radio station, look. Midfield, I heard. Yeah. But definitely the uh, the selector knob for the bandwidth. Yeah. So it's, it's had it, isn't it? Yeah. yeah. So it needs a good service. If there any, you go, Tubes, yeah. If anyone's got any ideas, it probably needs new capacitors, a good clean, yep. good everything. So you can just see us behind the box here. We, we're not going for glory hey. on this video. We're not looking for wonderful pictures. We're out of focus. We don't care. It's all about the radio. If you've got something like this, and you really love it to bits. Yeah, have a little clean, t clean it and lovingly play around with it. Don't touch anything high voltage, don't be silly. Don't go anywhere near beyond your capabilities like me and Simon, but we've actually got it working. So I'll say, well done, brother. Medium wave it is. We got it working, <laughs> that's all we got. But we did get something out of it. Now, if you was in the middle of nowhere, had no entertainment, you found that in the loft, it didn't work, you brought it down, did what we did, you'd now have a slightly working radio. And I'm chuffed to bits. We actually got a sound out of this thing. It hasn't played a tune in years. Anyway, thanks for watching. It's been very entertaining, as I'm sure you'll disagree. <laughs> and we'll see you on the next video of Take the Fear Out of Gear with me, Jason Bangers. And me, Mr. Chubbly Water. Oh, it's been a long one. We'll see you on the next video. To Lou, guys. See ya. Bye for now.